thrilled with the Bay Area. Families think they're buying new flat panel TVs, but when they get home, they're finding something else in the box. Lisa Chan shows us a new twist to an old scam that could have you thinking twice before you buy electronics on the street. That's crazy. Now that's new to me. I haven't heard of that one. There's a new scam on the street. Rocks in a box. This man did not want his face on camera. He's the manager of an apartment complex in Richmond where thieves broke into a storage room and apartments and stole more than 30 oven doors. And they're out on the streets. They're packaging them as plasma TVs and they're out on the streets selling them. Selling them for hundreds of dollars to people who think they're getting a great deal on a stolen plasma TV. A maintenance worker for the building should showed us how an oven door could be stolen in a matter of seconds. I heard of one person in Antioch bought a oven door, thought it was a plasma TV for $375 just recently. Thieves aren't just stealing from one apartment complex. Another building nearby had dozens of oven doors stolen. You really don't get something for nothing or next to nothing. So, I mean, that's probably the lesson here. I mean, if it sounds like it's too good to be true, chances are... It probably is. We found a man who did not want to be on camera because he says he's not only heard of the rocks in a box scam, but he did it. But a lot of people fell for it? Yeah, and they still fall for it. And just because I'm saying what I'm saying, they're still going to fall for it. You know, it's just the way it is. So you've been warned. Even Vacaville PD just arrested a man this week with the flat screen TV box filled with oven doors and tires. And to prove that a sucker is born every decade, this thing started back in the 80s. Scammers were putting bricks in boxes and they said they were selling them as VCRs.